Okay, red light is recording then. Okay, good morning. Uh, this is Dr. Sprocket. Uh, date is January 23rd at approximately uh, 6.55 a.m. Uh, this is uh, sneak peek experiment number three. Uh, the hypothesis thereof being that if I uh, dedicate my life to time travel, uh, that sometime in the future I will be able to travel uh, from there into uh, my present day and to, uh, to share with me uh, right now the, uh, the secret of time travel. And in order to facilitate that, I have uh, taken a box and I have uh, hidden it uh, here in the, uh, in the basement of my apartment block here. Uh, that was a week ago that I hid it and that should have given me plenty of time to travel from the future into the present day and leave some kind of, uh, you know, uh, communication uh, there in the box uh, for me in order to uh, discover the secret of time travel. Um, I have learned from uh, experimentations number one and two and uh, not to tell anybody else about, uh, about the work uh, that I'm... Uh, attempting to perform here. Uh, there apparently are certain um, jokesters and, and hoaxsters uh, who, who think it's funny to interfere uh, with the, uh, the pursuit of scientific knowledge by, by messing around with their experiments and uh, to uh, just otherwise um, uh, just get in the way. So I haven't told anybody about this. Uh, not a single person, and uh, and I feel confident that I am the only person uh, who knows about the location uh, of this box, other than uh, my future self, who would also know about the location of the box because they are they are me as well. Okay, so uh, so I'm going to be opening up the box here, and uh, we're going to see what's inside. And then hopefully it's, uh, it acts as a uh, as a, a time capsule of sorts uh, for for me from the future. So I'm going to uh, I'm going to go get the box now, and we're going to see what uh, what it contains. Okay. Okay. There's something in there. Okay, I think I think this is this is really it here. Okay, let's see what we got. Oh, there's stuff there. Okay, there's uh there appears to be an an empty can of pop in here. Um I mean, you know, not my uh, not my favorite kind of pop, but uh, it's it's good to see that that there is uh, you know pop in the future. This is um, most likely a future can of pop, which is is something, you know. Um, there's a uh, a half-eaten bag of chips. Um, um, Kind of cryptic items here, but there's a note, and uh, I'm sure that's going to uh, tie it all together here. It's written in my handwriting. Okay, to Dr. Sprocket, I owe you $300 from Dr. Sprocket. Oh, oh. What great, great. That is that is just great. I travel back in time to borrow three hundred dollars from myself. Just great. And I'm supposed to pay rent this month? How three hundred dollars? Where am I where am I supposed to get that from? Oh jeez. Oh no. I've gotta find some more stuff to take to the scrapper. Oh jeez. Three hundred dollars? What was I thinking? Jeez.